How did General Grievous capture Chancellor Palpatine just before Revenge of the Sith? Palpatine knew it was time to end the war, but he had many loose ends to tie up, including eliminating the Separatist leaders. Darth Sidious ordered Grievous to invade Coruscant with the goal of capturing the Chancellor. Leaving the engaged fleets above the planet, Grievous made his way to the planet's surface in 500 Republica, the apartment tower where Palpatine resided. Jedi Knights Shock T and Roran Karab arrived at the Chancellor's apartments, accompanied by a clone task force to escort him to safety. Knowing Grievous would arrive at any moment, Palpatine dismissed their concerns, refusing to flee in the face of the Separatist attack. In the middle of their debate, Grievous arrived. Eliminating Karab and the clones, the CIS general electrocuted Shock T, knocking her unconscious. Grievous fled with Palpatine to his ship, the Invisible Hand. Unable to stop General Grievous before boarding his shuttle, Mace Windu contacted Obi-Wan Kenobi and Anakin Skywalker, ordering them to return to Coruscant from the Outer Rim sieges and rescue the Chancellor. 